You go get the other one. What a crazy morning it's been already. Started off our morning with a Walmart Spark shopping order. Yeah, I think it was $31, a uh, couple items. It really wasn't, it was like 25 items. It was quick and easy. So we did that. We were doing that on the, on the live stream. And if you're not part of the live stream, I typically uh, stream every mornings uh, for about two to three hours, uh, going through the motions of what I do uh, first thing in the morning at grocery or food delivery. So we did that. That was uh, quick and easy. I think we got that done within 40 minutes or so. And then we had another shopping order, this one from DoorDash, uh, 50 items, a little high on the, on the item count, but paid out almost $40, 39 and some change. That was easy. We got that done in 40 minutes. So two orders back to back under two hours, made $80. And then we got this Instacart offer, $45, three customers, and I think it's the total units is like under 20. So this is awesome. Uh, we're going to hopefully bang this out in about maybe 30 minutes, maybe, and then do the drop-offs. The drop-offs is a little bit high on the mileage, but um, it actually sets us off. Uh, or drops us off at a location that is really, really popping right now. So we might get some orders down in that area. So I'm looking forward to doing that. Let's get into Sam's Club and do this order. <laughs> Well, kids, let me just tell you, boys and girls, I'm tired. I am exhausted. <sighs> I didn't even finish the last order, and the last order is the worst order. This Sam's Club order, it seemed like it was nothing. It was 18 items, but uh, it, it kicked my butt. It was six cases of water, large cases of water, and six cases of juices and drinks so like snapple and some other juices and such this was a tough tough order at sam's club it was definitely not easy um not fun either i thought i was going to be able to knock this thing out in about a half hour this is going to turn out to be a little over an hour which uh, which is fine because i mean it's good money either way it's 45 dollars and what what really made me take the offer because I, I accepted the offer and then I was going to cancel. Uh, I was going to cancel because, you know, it was just a far drive. I'm looking at the item count. I'm like, oh man, not the item count, but the type of items. I'm like, this is not, I'm just going to let this go. And I look at the order from the third one and sure enough, oh, hold on, let me get through here. Uh, this little circle. So it says on there, the guy says, and it's actually to a business, uh, uh, we'll tip extra after successful delivery. <laughs> so now, do you take that seriously that someone's going to tip you extra? I, and for me, I'm thinking, all right, it's already a $45 order. If he tips me $10 extra, and that becomes a $55 order. And guess what? $55 order takes about an hour. A little extra grease and elbow uh, elbow grease and just to, you know, 
pick up all those cases of water? No problem, I'll do it. Unfortunately, there's no way to actually know if he's going to do that or not. So it's to a burger place. I'm not going to say the burger name because there's only two locations um, and I don't want anyone to go to those locations if anything were to happen or do anything or whatever. So this is a, this was a tough order. Should I have done it? You know, at the end of the day, when I go home tonight and I look back at how much money I've made, I'm going to say, hey, I'm glad I took it, right? Uh, at this very moment, no, no. How you doing? I have a delivery. Do you want it inside or do you want it outside? Delivery? Yeah, from Sam's Club. No problem. Yep. Delivery? Yeah, do you want me to just bring it right in? Yeah. Here, come here. Yeah. Uh, I appreciate it. I had a car too, but not as big, so I appreciate yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, so, yeah, so yeah. What, what you basically do is just take it, load everything on, and then just put it right back. Just leave it right here. Yep. You got it. Thank you very yeah, much. Yeah, appreciate right it. Right here with everything. You got it. Yep. Yeah, we got a lot, so I'm not sure it's gonna. Here, yeah, so uh, I'll take. I'll take, uh, take. You wanna take those? Right. Yeah, yeah. Very heavy. Yeah. There you go. All right, so yeah, I'll take these. All right, I'll take. Uh, uh, and I'll take these. Okay. okay all right. Appreciate it. You, you got it. We'll do. Here, hold on, hold on. I'll get the door. You got it. No, no, no it's fine. You got it.
Yep, that's it. Oh. oh. I'm sorry about that. Here, here, you know what? Let me uh, take these out. They've all fit and then they didn't. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. Let me go get the other one. I got it. I apologize. Should have my cart. <laughs> Sometimes you just have to do a cancel. Sometimes you just have to know when to say no. That is, uh, that was not fun at all. Um, I don't know how much of that I showed. If I wanna make fun of myself, I would show it all. Um, that, that was a toughie, that was, that was tough. And not only was it tough, it, it sucked at the same time. I'm just, uh, I'm ready to be done with today. I'm ready to be done with today. <sighs> but we have to continue going. We have to, we have to, we have to go at least four, maybe even five more hours. I would really like to go six more hours and try to get double what I have now, which would bring me to maybe 250. <sighs> I should just go right on DoorDash. That's what I should do. But Spark, Spark might have something. Let's see what Spark has. As of right now, nothing. We'll see if that guy actually increases the tip. I mean, what's the definition of a successful delivery? Did you see that? Yeah, I posted it right here. A successful delivery that you'll only give a tip if it's successful. What does the definition of successful mean? Because I just screwed it all up and let everything fall out. So uh, drinks were flying all over the place. So does that now count as not being su successful or does successful mean, hey, as long as you just deliver, I'm gonna increase your tip. We're gonna find out, hopefully within the next two hours. All right, so after a quick break that we had, uh, we picked up this Santucci's Original Square Pizza, $15.50, catering bag required. It's our first one of the weekend. I am excited to take this. Uh, will it just be $15.50? I'm not really sure. It is two large pizzas, and those pizzas are expensive. They're like $25 a piece, maybe even more with DoorDash. They could be close to 30 some dollars. Uh, got some wings, chicken fingers, and fries, and some other uh, stuff, but it's eight total items. Uh, this, this is going to be a little bit uh, pricey. I have a feeling it's going to be larger than $15.50. Let's go over to the place. The nice thing is the drop-off is close to where we're at, so we might be able to head up something um, when we're done. But let's go pick up the pizza, put it in our catering bag, and do that drop-off. How you doing? I'm picking up a DoorDash, Marianne. Excellent, thank you. That's that's all of it, right? Everything. One, right two, here. three, four, five, six. Got some six, small seven. in here. Yep. Another small in here. Okay. 
large, large, and then every other thing. Excellent. Chicken fingers, fries, two things of fries. Perfect. Are all in. Excellent. Thank you very much. Appreciate course, you. Yeah. You have a great rest of your day. You too. How you doing? Hello. Hey. hey. Hey, would you like it right here? Do you want me to yeah. give it to you? Oh. Yeah, yeah. yeah. All right. Here's the one. Thank you. You got it. Here's the two smalls. All right. Not exactly where I'd like to be right now. It's at 2.30. I think we got like about $140. It's it's tight. It's it just like completely died out. Like completely died out. <sighs> I'm getting offers from Instacart, but these are all trash orders. Like we have a uh, $14.88 going eight miles, two customers, 34 items at two different stores. I, who's going to do that? That's that first off. That's probably going to take you at least an hour, at least. So you're already under the $15 an hour. It's just, is that really worth it? Uh, there's another one here at $25 going four miles, which isn't bad, but 80 units. Again, 80 units, that's, that's a lot of units. Uh, item count is 60. So 60 items is probably going to take you an hour, hour and a half. Um... Not that bad of a drive, but uh, it's not that great. So let me take a look at DoorDash real quick. So for DoorDash, we have nothing. So we're not getting anything with DoorDash. We're getting crappy offers on Instacart. We have no Spark since this morning. So I, I'm surprised that... Yeah, I really thought this weekend was going to be big, and I really thought Saturday was going to be the big day for grocery because people wanted to get the head start. Uh, obviously, that's not the case. All right, Instacart shoppers, I want to know something. Let me know if this is any way true. All right, so I've been using Instacart on an Android for the last few days. All right. Prior to that, it's always been on an iPhone. But just so because I've been doing the, the live streaming, I live stream on my iPhone. So I figured, let me use my Android just for the for the Instacart, my DoorDash. All right. So I've been using it and I've noticed something. I've noticed that the orders that come through are on a delay. And I couldn't really... And say if it was my phone or if it's an Android or maybe it's my network, but the two phones were side by side and I would get an order pop up notified or notification on my iPhone quicker than on the Android. Now I couldn't put any uh, any concrete like you know theories together. However, I'm in the parking lot just now. And there's an Acme order, I'm sorry, a ShopRite order that pops up $27 and some change going a mile and a half. I think it was like 20 items, not a big deal. But it came up so quick and then disappeared like that. The person next to me, I would say two or three parking spaces over, she got it. Now, she's not a diamond cart. I know that for a fact. So if she's not a diamond cart and she got the offer quicker, 
And I barely even saw it. I saw it very slightly on the Android. I have a feeling that there's an advantage by having the iPhone. Is there anyone who knows that for 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 fact, or is does it happen to them? I'm not going to be using my Android anymore for Instacart. Just won't be. Just thought that was interesting. Let me know down in the comments. All right, we're going to end it there. Just wasn't getting anything. We were in the parking lot. It was starting to fall asleep. <laughs> uh, no, I, it just no one's getting anything. I was just talking to someone who does uh, uh, Instacart and I mean, they only had three orders that they got. I mean, they've been supplementing with other things. They've been doing Grubhub and DoorDash, but it's been a bit, uh, slow for them too. It's been slow for everyone. It's interesting that it just completely died out in the last, I don't know, two and a half, three hours. Bad. Oh, remember that customer who I said was going to tip a little bit extra, right? Yeah, it was a little bit extra. It was $2 more. Yeah, okay. Like, it was really worth it. 